Hey guys and welcome back to a new tutorial video on my channel. This is going to be how to speed up Minecraft epically. It's going to take three things but you only really need one. So I'm going to show you how to get one, um, how to install it and um, you can look into getting the others yourselves because they are very easy. They're also free but it does speed up Minecraft hugely um, when they're all put together. So the, f the main thing I'm going to be showing you today is the Optifine mod. Um, so if you just type in Optifine, it will simply come up, but I think if you type in mod, it will come up on here, um, and it's easy for you to download. Um, so you just come on here, which will be, the link will be in the description, um, and this is where you download the um, Minecraft 1.2.5 or whatever version you're playing on. It will self-update, so you won't have to worry. Um, it will be there, but this is the one I'm downloading because this is what I'm currently playing on. Um, you just click download, which but I've already got it, so you don't need to do that. I don't need to do that, but you do. Um, and I will now show you how to install it. So what uh, I'm going to download it anyway because I'm going to show you what the process you need to do to install it. But it's very very simple. Uh, it's like most mods. It's like too many items um, and other simple mods like that. Uh, you just come on here. You click skip add, and you can come on to this and simply click download Optifine. So I'm going to open that now, and I'm going to drag it over to the side, uh, close that, open it to the side, and then I can, now I'm done on here, we can come back to the home screen, and the next thing you're going to want to do is get to your bin fi uh, file, so you want to go percent app data percent just like that, so you can see in the, um, where I'm typing it in, at the top, you press enter, and then you can go onto your .minecraft, and then your bin folder. This is where you'll find your minecraft.jar. So you, what you want to do is you want to go open and winrar archiver. So you're going to need winrar to do uh, any mod installing. So bear that in mind. So what you need to do is you need to open it up. You don't have to do it to the side, but I just prefer doing it. And then you want to select all of these files like so and literally just drag them into there and just press um, OK. So I don't think it should corrupt my Minecraft if I do it anyway, but um, you just press OK and you can download it straight into there. So you can close them both off and make sure, I'm going to show you now actually, you want to make sure that when you open your Minecraft.jar that there is no folder saying MetaInf in capital letters. If you're doing that, you need to delete it because that will stop any um, mods being able to be installed as that's the only way that uh, Jeb or Notch try to stop you from installing mods onto Minecraft, but hey, what's Minecraft without mods anyway? So once that's done, the one, the two things that I do do, <laughs> do do, um, you, I always click on this thing called Gamefire, which I downloaded, so you can look into getting that yourself. So it's called Gamefire, like that. Uh, I'll probably put the link for it in the description, um, and you can look into downloading that yourself, um, and send it up. You can find I've got a couple of other videos if you go down to my channel you can find it um, and what it does is it simply makes your computer look like utter shit but it compl it c increases your um, how, like the speed you play at hugely uh, the other thing that you can do is you can get this thing called game booster I'm not going to do it because it closes down all other programs I'm using so recording is not a good idea but you come up here you select your minecraft and press boost and launch and what that does is it closes any unnecessary unnecessary processes that your computer is currently running so um, like that you don't need it doesn't harm your computer in any way and it speeds up Minecraft in that region uh, region reason so sorry I'm kind of talking like a retard today we are gonna go into my Minecraft I'm gonna show you how to use this mod so to increase it uh, we'll go into my Minecraft mission world uh, this is back to where we were before. Um, if you want to go check that out, you can. But um, what you need to do is you'll come onto here and you'll give you get all these new settings in your video settings. So you just click onto this here, and then what you do is the settings that I always have it on are fast. Uh, your render distance is up to you. If I'm recording, I always have it on times plus 16 because you can see relatively uh, far. But it keeps your computer, my computer, running at a very steady, uh, decent frame rate. And then the next thing you're going to want is max FPS for performance. Um, you're going to want 
most of these are kind of to your own personal preference but smooth lighting does kind of affect it ever so slightly but the main thing that you're going to want to do is turn fog off as you can see off says no fog fastest um, under where fast is faster fog and fancy slower fog and but looks better you want it to turn off that will increase your game hugely I know it sounds odd but it does so trust me when I say that and then on here you're gonna want anything that you kinda want off so I'm gonna turn void particles and rain splash off because I don't need them textures animate I'm gonna keep on just because I want to portal particles you don't really need them water particles you may want them on uh, rain splash I may turn on but the two that you kinda want off are lava animated and water animated because they're the two things that you'll run into especially water and you don't really need them because well that's the one thing that kind of affects how it looks that and the fog but as you can see it's not moving at all but it still looks relatively decent so that's another thing that you're going to want to kind of choose but the other things that you're going to need are smooth FPS on and dynamic updates off I think it may be off by default yeah but um, you want basically you want these settings then quality if you have all these you have it off and you can have all of them off but some of them aren't really really very relevant um, and that's pretty much and all you want all you want all these on fast so that's pretty much what this uh, mod gives you it's so good because it really does increase any speed that um, well any minecraft on any computer to a huge great big speed um, and it's just such a good mod and I would really recommend it to anyone so yeah thank you very much for watching guys um, this has been how to install and use the Optifine mod as well as a insight into Gamefire and Game Booster 3 and yeah this has been a tutorial on Jake's is the names channel so thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. See you guys later. Zah.